Have you ever marveled at the beauty and power of aircraft in motion and wished you could capture it in a photograph? Welcome to the thrilling world of aviation photography, a unique blend of passion for both aviation and photography. This genre offers endless opportunities to capture the majesty of flight, the elegance of design, and the sheer power of these magnificent flying machines. It doesn't matter if you're standing at the edge of an airfield, attending a bustling air show, or simply peering through a fence. Each location offers a unique perspective and a chance to capture something truly special. So, get ready to combine your love for planes with your photography skills. In this video, we'll walk you through some easy-to-follow steps to enhance your aviation photography skills. Just like aviation itself, preparation is key in aviation photography. And this preparation starts long before you even reach your shooting location. The first thing to consider is your personal comfort. You'll likely be on your feet for extended periods, so comfortable shoes are a must. Remember, if you're comfortable, you can focus more on capturing those amazing shots. Also, pack sunscreen to protect your skin and a hat to shield your eyes from the sun. You'll be spending a lot of time outdoors, and the last thing you want is a sunburn or squinted eyes ruining your focus. Next, let's talk about equipment. Binoculars are an often overlooked tool in aviation photography, but they can be incredibly useful. Aircraft can pass by in seconds, and binoculars can help you spot them in the distance, giving you those precious extra moments to prepare for that perfect shot. Now, onto the heart of your gear, your camera. Always, always pack extra batteries and memory cards. The action in aviation photography can be fast and frantic, and the last thing you want is your camera dying or running out of memory, just as that vintage Spitfire roars overhead. The essence of aviation photography lies in its spontaneity. Aircraft won't wait for you to change batteries or clear up memory space. You need to be ready at a moment's notice, and that means having your gear primed and ready to capture the magic. And finally, it's all about quick response times. The difference between an amazing shot and a missed opportunity can be a matter of seconds. Keep your camera at the ready, anticipate the aircraft's movements, and be prepared to snap at just the right moment. So pack wisely, prepare thoroughly, and always be ready for action. This genre of photography is as dynamic as the aircraft you're capturing, and your preparation should reflect that dynamism. Remember, a well-prepared photographer is a successful one. Choosing the right camera and lens can greatly enhance your aviation photography. So, let's dive right into it, shall we? It's essential to remember that the best camera is the one you have with you. However, if you're looking to invest, consider a camera with fast autofocus and high ISO performance. This will ensure you're ready to capture those fleeting moments when an aircraft zooms past. Now let's talk lenses. Telephoto lenses are often the go-to for air shows, able to zoom in and capture aircraft in flight from a distance. But don't underestimate the power of a versatile lens. A lens like the Canon EF 24 to 105 mm is an excellent choice, offering both reach and portability. This lens can help you capture both wide-angle shots of the entire air show and close-ups of planes zooming past. But why stop there? Experiment with different lenses. A wide-angle lens can help you capture the scale of an air show, while a macro lens can open up possibilities for detailed shots of aircraft parts. Now, you might be wondering about tripods. In aviation photography, they're not often used. The dynamic nature of the genre calls for mobility. You'll be moving around, changing your angle, and following the action in the sky. A tripod can limit your flexibility, so keep light and mobile, ready to move and explore different angles at a moment's notice. Remember, the gear is just a tool. Your creativity and ability to adapt to changing situations are what will truly set your photos apart. With the right camera and lens, you are one step closer to capturing stunning aviation photographs. Stay tuned as we delve into setting up your camera in the next segment. Understanding and setting up your camera correctly is crucial in aviation photography. Every click counts, and you don't want to miss a split-second shot because your settings were off. So, let's dive into the nitty-gritty of camera settings for aviation photography. Firstly, we have the ISO. This controls the camera's sensitivity to light. For well-lit conditions, which you'll typically find at an air show or airport during the day, an ISO range between 200 and 800 is recommended. 
This ensures your images will be bright without introducing too much noise or grain. Next, let's talk about aperture, which controls the amount of light entering your camera. In aviation photography, you want to keep as much of the plane in focus as possible. To achieve this, opt for a narrower aperture, specifically in the range of f16 to f22. This will give you a deeper depth of field, ensuring that both the plane and the background are in sharp focus. Lastly, there's shutter speed. This dictates how long your camera sensor is exposed to light. In a genre where your subjects are moving at high speeds, a fast shutter speed is crucial. A range between 1 200 to 1 500 seconds is recommended to freeze the action and capture crisp, clear images of the aircraft. You might be wondering, why these specific settings? Well, these recommendations are based on the common conditions you'll encounter in aviation photography. They aim to balance lighting, focus, and speed to produce vibrant, sharp images of these magnificent flying machines in action. Remember, these settings are a starting point. Don't be afraid to tweak and experiment based on your environment and the effect you're after. Photography, after all, is as much about technical precision as it is about creative expression. With your camera set up correctly, you're ready to start shooting. Tune in to our next segment where we'll discuss composition and creativity in aviation photography. Until then, keep your eyes on the skies and your finger on the shutter button. Composition and creativity can make the difference between a good aviation photograph and a great one. This truth is especially applicable in aviation photography, where the subjects are not only dynamic, but also breathtakingly powerful. Let's start with the basics. Experimentation is key. Try capturing aircraft from various angles and perspectives. Maybe it's a low-angle shot of a jet as it soars overhead, or a close-up of a propeller caught in mid-spin. You could even try capturing the reflection of a plane in a puddle after a rain shower. It's all about thinking outside the box. Also, pay attention to your backgrounds. A clean, uncluttered background can make your subject stand out, while a busy one can distract from the aircraft's beauty. Look for clear skies, open fields, or simple structures that don't compete for attention. And whenever possible, try to minimize obstructions like fences or power lines. Now let's talk about opportunities. Air shows and fly-ins present unique chances for up-close shots. Here, you can capture not only the aircraft, but also the people interacting with them, adding a human element to your photos. You might see a child's awe as they see a plane up close for the first time or a pilot's concentration as they prepare for takeoff. These moments of interaction can add depth and emotion to your aviation photography. But remember, the most important aspect of composition and creativity is enjoyment. Photography is, above all, a form of self-expression. So don't be afraid to take risks and try new things. After all, the most stunning photos often come from unexpected places. With a creative approach to composition, you can capture truly unique and stunning aviation photographs. Capturing the beauty and power of aircraft in motion can be a rewarding experience. As we wrap up, let's quickly revisit the key points we've covered in this journey. Preparation is vital. Comfortable gear, binoculars, and extra camera essentials will make your experience smoother. Your choice of camera and lens can greatly influence your results. While telephoto lenses are ideal, a versatile lens like the Canon EF 24 to 105 mm can also do wonders. Remember, tripods aren't commonly used in this dynamic field. Settings play a crucial role too. With ISO, aim for 200 to 800 in well-lit conditions. Aperture-wise, F16 to F22 will help keep the plane in focus, and a shutter speed between 1 200th to 1 500th seconds will freeze the action. Lastly, let your creativity run wild. Experiment with different angles, clean backgrounds, and capture the action in various stages. Air shows and fly-ins provide unique opportunities for close-up shots. Remember, your love for planes will shine through in your photography. Plan ahead, be patient, and enjoy the adventure of capturing these magnificent flying machines.